everyone? Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com, from Ron Parmeter's basement. He has me locked in here with chains. He's got me fucking cleaning up dead bodies and shit. It's all good, man. He's got me wearing ball gags and chained to a treadmill because he says I'm too fat. Motherfucker. Anyway, guys, I'm in Plattsburgh, New York. Epic training footage from Albany Strength with David LeClaire. And a few guests to join us. Some people came down just to see us. We're a transparent company. We ain't like, oh, win a contest to train with us. No, no, no. Here's where we're at, bitch. If you want to train, train. Now, it's different. We do the, the big deal in uh, August. We're going to run a contest. Big J's Extreme Brothers and Iron 2 with Pro Subs. It's going to be sweet. Stay tuned. I just got to write up the legal shit for that. Anyway, guys, you saw at the beginning of the video... I'm drier than a 90-year-old's vagina after sitting in the sauna for two days straight. Big, dry piece of roast beef. Feel great. Flew in here, went straight to the gym, crushed it at Albany Strength. Drove up to Plattsburgh, got some good sleep last night with that Resurrect PM by Ronnie Coleman. By the way, people coming to the show tomorrow, we got enough Resurrect PM samples for damn near most people in the crowd. So we're good to go. We got machine shirts I'm going to be throwing out during my guest posing, which by the way, I have something planned for you, and if it goes like I think it will, it might go down as the most epic guest posing ever. Yo, Ron! Ron, come here, man. The people want to talk to you, man. They're requesting you. It's your fucking basement. Got me tied up to the treadmill with a ball gag. Dude. Okay, it's Ron Parmeter. IFPA Pro, promoter of the Uprising. What do you got to say about your show? This guy's got way too much energy. <laughs> it's going to be a good time, though. Uh, what else was it? What? And if you're a skinny white guy, volunteer at the beginning of the show because we're going to need you. Well, we're going to have some fun training and... What are we training at chest? You changed it like three times. Fuck, dude, I did. <laughs> chest is fucking Friday, man. Chest and arms. See, look, we got all this shit for the competitors down here. Oh, uh, look at that. Um, anyway. Yeah, that's all That's all stuff that we sent, other stuff, trophies. We got a oh, bunch of shirts, a yeah. bunch of Resurrect PM samples. Ron, how'd you sleep on that shit? I slept good. That stuff's awesome, isn't yeah, it? I'm still trying to wake up. and Woke up with the strangest boner. He showed it to me. <laughs> but, uh, strangest. That was a boner. Yeah, I have nothing to talk about. Mark <laughs> catches me off guard a little bit. A little bit. I told you I'd be calling you down here. Right. So, Ron, thank you. Uprising is tomorrow. 3 p.m., drive to Plattsburgh. It's only seven hours from everywhere else on planet Earth. Seven hours from Russia, seven hours from Albany. Yeah, dude, this treadmill has like a track two inches long. Anywho, what am I going to go over today? Water. I get a lot of emails. Mark, you're really dry. Hence the comment about the 90-year-old grandmother in the sauna um, with her vagina being really dry. Here's the deal. I like vaginas. No, I'm not talking about vaginas. Um, here's the deal. If you, here, here's my theory and how I bring people into shows. My brother was dry. I come in dry. I don't believe in dropping water. I don't believe in taking diuretics. Here's the deal. Where do you store water? In your subcutaneous. If you're lean enough, now I'm not saying wake up in the morning, have 10 gallons of water the day you show. But I'm saying that the least you need to do is cut it back and drop down to sips the night before and into the show. Don't be thirsty. Don't be dehydrated. It's going to just make you look worse. Be stressed out. You look like shit. If you are lean enough, you do not need to drop water. The only time I see dropping water working is when you got an IFBB guy who's not lean enough, who needs every edge he can get to show the muscle, who's enhanced, who takes something like a diazide or a Lasix, or an aldoctone, prescription diuretics, and brings it in. However, for those of us who like having kidneys, and those natural competitors, I see no need to do anything but to diet your fucking ass off and get lean enough. If you're lean and dry, you're lean and dry. Let's see if I get a shot here. That's about as lean and dry as you're gonna get. Any, any dryer, where's it going to come from? Where's the water going to come from? 
It's gonna come from intramuscular. Make you look flat, stringy, like shit. So you're either lean or you're not. There's no last minute hocus pocus or voodoo. All right? Tomorrow night, Uprising, Plattsburgh, New York. I'll be there, starts at 3 p.m. I'll be judging most likely. Also be guest posing. Afterwards, if you're here, if you came to see me, we have our own room at the ground round. If I like you, I'll buy you dinner. If I don't like you, go F yourself and go to Burger King across the street and have it your motherfucking way. What? Cause it's not a game. Yeah, check it out, yeah. 2013. Uh, listen, yeah. I would applaud you, but I don't bear arms. My thoughts are the scare guard across the square off. Slither with snakes, let out the letter in. We start like Jack Bowers phone. I don't need a recharge, yeah. We all collapse the crib.